in many ways, abstractions are like subpatchers. So allow me to construct something here that just creates some audio, but an easy DAC, and let's just go, let's create a sine wave, which is a cycle uh, MSP object, and we'll give it a frequency like this. Uh, and then maybe just to keep the volume uh, in uh, control here a little bit, we'll just do something like this. And if we hook this up, uh, right, you'll hear a sign tone of however many frequencies. There we go. Okay. Um, and of course, we could duplicate this if we wanted three voices, for example, and just connect these things all. Another way to do it, as I mentioned, is you can create a subpatcher, P. And I'll just drag this over here, right? And then I'll cut this out and bring this back into the subpatcher, make it a little bit more um, visible. And for subpatchers, we use inlets and outlets. Correct, All right? And then we have another way of actually um, encapsulating, as they call it. Uh, some code that you've written, right? So you do that, you hide it a little bit, and you still get the same thing, right? And the beautiful thing about this is that you don't get a real messy cut and paste, right? You can actually just cut and paste, uh, or you just cut, uh, uh, duplicate the subpatcher itself, and all that code gets duplicated within it. 